It's a rescue mission the likes of which the Humane Society of the United States has never faced before. 4,000 beagles uh, has got to land. This is one of the largest uh, transfer operations in the history of at least the Humane Society of the United States. 4,000 beagles given a new leash on life after a federal judge approved a plan to rescue and relocate the dogs from a facility in Cumberland, Virginia last week. The U.S. Department of Agriculture saying the facility in Vigo violated several federal regulations and Vigo's parent company announcing last week that the facility is being shut down. When any kind of animal operation closes its doors of this magnitude, the big question is where will they go? Humane Society of the United States or HSUS employing their animal rescue team. We do have uh, the assets and the expertise to create temporary shelters, to rehabilitate animals in need, and also partners that answer to that call as well. The group has 60 days to get the rescue plan in place. What are you most anxious for as this rescue operation gets underway? I would say day one. Day one when we first appear on site and we have a broader scope of the work to come. HSUS working with shelters across the country who can transport and house the beagles. It's about 350 organizations nationwide that will be calling on to assist us in this operation. Homeward Trails Animal Rescue is just one of those partners. The Virginia Bay Shelter has already taken in 500 beagles from the same facility in the spring. And now they're gearing up to help find forever homes for the remaining 4,000. 4,000 beagles. If you'd like to help, you can head to humanesociety.org for ways to donate or adopt, Andrew. Or if you work with a shelter or a rescue organization and want to get involved in the relocation mission, you can email beagles at humanesociety.org as well. How adorable. You ended with that shot with the little beagle with the blue oh, the eyes. Puppy. Yeah. Somebody oh, somewhere just ordered 3,999 <laughs> beagles. <laughs> but the one thing to remember, too, is you don't necessarily have to adopt a beagle. If you adopt another dog or cat, that opens up a kennel or uh, mm. a spot in a shelter for one of these beagles to move into. Very, very good point. Although 3,999 beagles would make a great Disney movie. Uh I hear company. Oh. <laughs> and then an evil woman comes through <laughs> and loves their fur. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.